When humans are going back to the moon, they will need robotic support. Today we are going to build a robotic arm. We often use nature and the human body as inspiration for technical designs, and we try to model robotics on what we observe around us. Robotic arms are machines that are based on the constitution of the human arm. They have mechanical components that function as muscles, joints, and bones, just like in our arm. As there are limitations to what humans can do, we often use robots to help carry out tasks that would be difficult, dangerous, or impossible for us. For this activity, you will need popsicle sticks with holes, or you can use a hole puncher to create holes in the sticks, split pin paper fasteners, a cork, cardboard, a cutter, and a hot glue gun. Let's get started. First, cut two slices off the cork. Then use the cutter to cut two rectangles from the cardboard that are big enough to hold the cork later on. Lay out the popsicle sticks that will form your robotic arm. You need handles, three crosses in the middle, and the pliers at the end. Let's pin it. We need pins for the connections between two sticks and in the middle of each cross. Now we're ready to build. Take the handles and use the hot glue gun to glue the sticks from the first cross to the handle. If you like, push the pins through as they will help the sticks stay in position as the glue cools. Be very careful not to burn your fingers with the hot glue. Repeat this once more for the tip of our robotic arm that will function like pliers. While your glue gun is still hot, glue the cork to the cardboard and let everything cool down. Now pin it. This already looks like a robotic arm. Now let's add the final touches and enable it to grab things. Use the hot glue gun one last time to glue the cardboard to the tip of the robotic arm. The cork slices should face each other. Wait for it. And now, grab it. Robotic arms can have various sizes and purposes. They can perform maintenance work and be equipped on scientific experiments. In space, robotic arms can be used to manipulate and transport large equipment and assist astronauts during spacewalks outside the International Space Station. ESA is currently working with the Canadian and Japanese space agencies on robotic missions to the moon. These missions will use autonomous rovers with robotic arms to collect samples from the lunar surface. <laughs>